The credit quit network is decentralized. Each node in the network verifies if a new block is compliant with the network standard. If a node thinks a block is not compliant, the node will ignore the block and any blockchain that includes the block. Suppose you want to introduce a change to the credit quit network. You believe that your change will improve the network for the better. However, if the software update changes the network standard, in that case, blocks generated from the updated version are incompatible with nodes running the legacy version and vice versa. Thus, we need a transition period to reach a consensus among nodes in the credit quit network to switch from one version to another irreversibly. We call this a hard fork. Each update can have a different transition process. In general, nodes that accept your proposal will start running the update and the others won't. Note that the Credit Coin Foundation is not the only entity that can propose a hard fork to the Credit Coin network. Anyone can decide to submit an irreversible change to the network. At the same time, the network may or may not accept the submission.